<laughs> Did you know that computing is now a newly accepted pathway for direct school admission? With more than 50 schools in Singapore offering it through robotics and STEM. If you are looking up to open up a new pathway for your child, this may be it. Music, Taekwondo and other art pathways may take years of mastery, whereas robotics and computing only requires around 1-2 to two years to master. So, while other kids are still struggling to master grade 4 and 5 for piano, your child is already on their way to their preferred secondary school. Computational thinking is also a mandatory module for local universities in NTU, NUS, SMU and SUTD. It's not just for computer science or engineering. Even students that are studying law, arts or the medical sciences are also required to take it. Now, you may be wondering, how does DSA work for computing? The only prerequisite to apply direct school admission is by participating in competitions such as National Robotics Competition and also First Lego League. Hey there, I'm Daniel, the head instructor handling STEM coding and robotics at First Step Academy. Here at FSA, we gear your child up for DSA by diving into robotics and coding. This helps them reach a skill level where they qualify for readout competitions such as the National Robotics Challenge and also First Lego League. Quite a few of our students have even clinched awards at this competition. Here is one of our students, Jace, at his latest project. This is an ATV robot that I have built. I wanted to make this project because it's like a very unique vehicle. It can drive on rough terrain. So this ATV uses a Lego Redo hub and two motors to power. The front motor, Motor B, activates the direction of where the ATV is turning, left and right. While the back motor, Motor A, controls the forward and backward movement of the ATV. Both are using gear transmission to work. After I had built this robot, it was time to make it move. I love how we can make the robot move just by typing in the right code. It's like giving them superpowers. We then get our students to create a portfolio of all the projects that they have completed under our curriculum, showcasing the intricate thought process behind their builds. We will also train them on their presentation and public speaking skills to ultimately prepare them for the IDSA interview which can make or break your child's chances. We also use the same syllabus that's actually recognized by Harvard Graduate School as a partnership with the 21st Century STEM organization. Since 2016, computing has been an O-level subject that the students can opt to check for their L1R4-5. By taking the first step in coding and robotics with us, you can be well assured that your child is prepared to check on computing well beyond the GSA application. It's no secret why many students have already succeeded in their applications and have gone to their preferred schools. If you wish to set your child up for success in the robotics and coding world, click on the link now to register your interest and we'll speak to you soon.